Well, we are at the Toyota ATO Sport of Racing and Ranvijay is here with us. Uh, he is a very enthusiastic person when it comes to motor racing and That's true. cars and Bikes motorcycles and, cars, and everything. Yeah. Yeah. And he is in general a very uh, you know, charismatic personality with a lot of passion for speed, thrill and... Adventure, everything. Everything that uh, can get you hurt. <laughs> so, uh, Ranvijay, uh, first question. Uh, how do you find Toyota Etios cars on the racetrack? I think uh, I was pleasantly surprised because uh, uh, Etios is a car that you can actually go buy in a, in a showroom. It's a stock car. So the one that I sat in, the only modification was nothing was done to the engine. It was just there was a roll cage and of course there was a performance exhaust. Uh, so a lot of credit goes to the driver but uh, the spin that I had, the couple of laps that I had uh, in the Etios, it was exciting there was a lot of adrenaline pumping there was a lot of skidding and and the control was amazing so there there was the the track is narrow and there are lots of bends so you've got to be mostly turning and and pretty much drifting and it has to be in control so the car had a lot of control and uh, for a stock car it, it's really pretty pretty good uh, and that's what i want to tell people that if you buy this uh, you don't have to race on the road so just just remember that it's it's a car that you can use in your daily life. It's not just a racing car, but um, if you modify it and if you have a track to practice on, this is a good car to do that. Uh, and with the Etios Racing, uh, with Etios Motor Racing, what I feel is that it's one of those companies that Toyota that has is giving that platform and that opportunity to a lot of young kids to take up motorsport as a profession. And I wish I was younger, much younger, because you can't really start it in your late 20s and I had this opportunity to be in this new India where motorsport was a career choice and uh, really kudos to uh, Toyota to do such an event where young talent will be taken, the, the, the winners will be taken abroad to uh, compete with other, you know, the best in the world and that's just amazing and I, I just, in front of my eyes in the last 10 years, motorsports become so big, there are so many race tracks. Earlier I used to tell people that, you know, if you want to race, why don't you go on a track? But people used to turn around and say, well, there is no track. And now there are so many tracks coming and there are so many companies that have their own personal tracks and you can just go uh, practice there. And if you have it, they will be... Because see, to be picked up in the Indian cricket team is difficult. But if you have the racing talent and naturally you're, you have that kind of a bent, companies will pick you up right away. We have our own F1 track. We are, have our own F1 team. We have a guy who drives for an F1 team and uh, events like this so uh, and the youth is interested you know every even when motorsport was not in india we used to watch it on television all the time and today we're just, i'm just happy i can still hear the engine, engines uh, revving so yeah that was on a different note uh, motorsports is very exciting and adventurous at the same time people who are going to adventures on the public roads actually end up in troubles so any message you would like of to give course, to youth like, yeah See, the thing is, I've done a show called Stuntmania, right. where you're not even riding a bike or racing it, you're, you're on one wheel or you're jumping or you're through fire and all. So a lot of times people ask me this question, you need to understand when we do that, one, we are professionals when we do that. We practice six to eight hours, these kids. So when you're racing on a racetrack and you can do all those things, you're wearing your gear, you're wearing a helmet, you're wearing a safety equipment, you have a roll cage inside the car. The car has its own safety measures when the when the company is making, but inside you have a roll cage. Around the track there are tires that even if you bang into something, you don't get hurt. You just bounce back. And these guys are the best. So if, if people on the road think they are racers, first of all, they're not the best because if they were the best, they were on the racetracks. Secondly, there are other there is traffic. There are other people whose lives are in danger. Here, so if you that's what I keep telling people, if you want to race, come on the racetrack and show what you got because uh, it's just foolish to be on the road and you know drive drinking and driving is just I, I don't think people don't understand how dangerous it is once it happens to them then only well, why should they wait for that uh, and up up north especially because in Bombay what happens is that there is no you can't cross lanes because it's just that much and there's, there's so much traffic but here I see the roads are becoming much better but uh, there is enough opportunity to speed but I think I keep telling people to go on the track to practice not on the road. Safe than sorry. Yeah see if you enjoy driving now see this is the you have driving pasand hai, wouldn't you want to do for a longer period of your life forever instead of just driving really really fast for a couple of years and just 
meeting an accident where you can't drive at all or if you die. So I say if you like something you want to do, just do it safely so you can do it for the rest of your life. So I ride bikes, but I wear my helmet, my gloves that have safety, knee pads and everything so that I can ride forever and don't want to meet with an accident where I lose a leg where I can't ride at all. So I think slowly and steadily people are getting it and you know with an event like this when people see that yes I can do this, I have an opportunity more and more awareness, awareness will be generated. So that's that's it. And it'll take time. But what are your favorite motorcycles and cars in India, or the uh, ones you own? See you know, the ones you really that I like. The ones that I own are the ones that I really like. Uh, but I'd like to get my hands on a Hellcat. It's it's a kind of a bike, an MV Augusta. Um, see, uh, everybody thinks that the Harley Davidson is the epitome. But no, I'd like to get a nice sports cruiser. And uh, I have a sports tour, I have a, a sports bike, I have a nice dirt bike, I have a Charisma, um, I have an Enfield. You must have a, li a really large garage. It's it's <laughs> in different places in the, because Bombay doesn't have Then I have, a, I, have, I have a couple of cars. But I think the on roadies we travel a lot. And the, the most comfortable car, and I'm not saying it because I'm not a Toyota, this thing is the Innova. It's got great... Uh, power, it's got great control, it's so comfortable and even wherever I go, if I'm going for an event and it's not in Mumbai, I always have a Toyota Innova. So that's one of the cars that we use the most in our lives when we're not in Bombay. And on roadies also we have the Innovas that take us from one place to the other if I'm not riding the bike. So yeah, I think those are the cars that we use most. And my favorite car would be the Bugatti Veyron. It is just crazy. It is the fastest. I have a two-door sports car. But which is, it's not a supercar. It's a it's a sports car. I have one. I don't know. Should I? It's the SLK 350 AMG. Okay. Yeah, that's the one. Thanks, Ranveer, for talking. Don't have to any us. place to drive fast on it. So I I took one a friend's uh, Lamborghini to the F1 track with okay. with a friend, and so yeah, we went on the track even with a fast car. We can't really speed on the roads. Makes sense to drive on that yeah. track rather yeah, than on I've the roads and endanger yourself and others. Yeah, and you can do much more. You can do speeds up to 260, 270 with safety. Too. You're wearing helmets and there is crash. Everything is great, man. I mean, there's no. You have a great time and nobody's worried about you. You know, your family is so much at stake. So, yeah, it's good. Thanks for talking to Thanks, us. Man. It pleasure. was really nice meeting My you. pleasure. Cheers. This is Rohit Purana signing off from Car Blog India. Thank you.